doctor. Please help me. What's going on here? I told her she had to stay in bed. She demanded we call you. I'm going to my exhibition. Frida. I've waited for a show in my own country my whole life. I'm not going to miss it. <laughs> <coughs> If the bronchitis gets worse, it will turn into pneumonia. <coughs> Frida, under no circumstances are you to leave this bed. I'll bring you back all the gossip, I promise. Christina! There was this skinny kid with his eyebrows shouting up at me. Diego! But of course, she made me come down to her. <laughs> I did, and I've never stopped looking. But I want to speak about Frida not as her husband, but as an artist, an admirer. Her work is acid and tender, hard as steel. Fine as a butterfly's wing. Lovable as a smile. Cruel as the bitterness of life. I, I, I don't believe that ever before has a woman put such agonized poetry on canvas. Shut up, Anson. Who died? Where is the music? You see, Dr. Zito, I followed your orders. I didn't leave my bed. Frida. Hi, Doctor. If you let me have this tequila, I promise not to drink at my funeral. To Frida! Salías del templo un día llorona cuando al pasar yo te vi. Salías del templo un día llorona cuando al pasar yo te vi. Hermoso pipil llevabas llorona que la vida. 